actually two words? Yes, it is. Those are some, some of the reasons, but another reason is that bees are also losing their habitat. Poor bees are being attacked and they're losing their homes. I wish there was something we could do to help them. What are some lazy things we can help? We can teach people about how bees are good for the environment. Maybe we could even plant flowers that the bees could use for food. I'm going to put a beehive in my bedroom. <laughs> oh, buddy. Yes. Those are some great ideas. Um, except for the beehive in the bedroom. The backyard, backyard work teaching us about bees is very important. We can be pollinators of knowledge. I want to do everything I can to help the bees. We will all save the bees.
another round of applause for our amazing today and for supporting your students and us through all of this. I'm sure you've heard a lot of practicing at home over the last few months. Maybe once or twice, I don't know. Uh, so thank you for taking the time to run lines with all of our students and practicing songs and dances with our bees and making sure that these lovely students could shine today, which they sure did. Uh, next on my list of thank yous is Mr. Pendino and his custodial staff team who came in here and turned this cafeteria into an auditorium for you to enjoy the show and have the time. Huge thank you to them. We'd like to thank Dr. Z and Mr. T for helping us get this project off the ground and giving us time needed to plan prepare lessons and materials, engage our students in this process, and carve out an hour of our day each day to practice so that it could be what it was today. Thank you, Dr. Z. And thank you to Mrs. Eugene, who stepped in as a new administrator on our team and helped coordinate logistics for today's performance, as well as gave support to this project from the minute she stepped in. So thank you, Mrs. Eugene. We'd like to thank Sarah's Garden and Nursery for answering our students' request for seed donations. Uh, they wrote letters asking for these and uh, they, they showed up for our students, so thank you. Uh, Mr. Vane, thank you for letting us use the stage and a few music stands and some drumsticks as well and for helping us with sound and lights. Mrs. Holman, thank you for planning with our team, working with me to design the choreography, dedicating music class time to rehearsing the music for the show, working with students on stage presence and diction, so it could be stars, thank you. Uh, thank you to Ms. Larder for planning with our team, designing, printing, and producing our playbill, and working with students during our library class time to design a Canva flyer insert for each program. Those were made by the students. Thank you to Mrs. Perry, our art teacher, for planning with our team and making our vision come to life through this amazing sculpture and set design project that she worked on with students. Uh, students completed these during their art class to create our beehive that you see on stage today, and many of you may have seen at the art show. So each student designed their own part of the hive, um, and it was put together to become our set. Thank you to Mrs. Shirley, Mrs. Asiha, and Ms. Pasquarella for their support during our rehearsals. Thank you to Mrs. Scarpula for helping to lead bee rehearsals, designing our seating chart for the bees, staying late to help create displays, leading the general choreography during today's production, and putting heart, soul, and energy into this all throughout the project. Thank you so much. And thank you to Mrs. Snyder for having this vision and initiating the project on our team. She saw this potential in our students and school for greatness, along with designing, sewing all the bee costumes, writing our project proposal, working with the students and teachers to bring our script to life, and leading the students during today's production. She also poured heart and soul into this project. Thank you, Mrs. Snyder. Mrs. Snyder's husband, Mr. Snyder, wrote and recorded all of the original songs for this production. Uh, he talked with our students about the creative process, and he also worked to get this play copywritten so that we could perform it and world premiere for you all this week. And so thank you, Mr. Snyder. And lastly, thank you so much to this amazing group of second graders. We literally couldn't have done it without you. Let's have one more round of applause for us. I will now turn it 
over to Mrs. Eugene for some directions about dismissal. Thank you so much for being here today. All right. So um, at this time, 